Muy buenas, ¿qué tal? Estamos aquí, volvemos en L Anuar y vamos a continuar justo donde lo dejamos con el segundo caso de antivicio, espero no sea tan largo como el anterior, ni tan complicadillo, por favor, aunque al bueno, al final, no hubo interrogatorios finales en las que cagarla, pero bueno, bien, vamos a darle. Madre de Dios. You know a Freddy Calhoun? Sure, I know Freddy. Freddy needs money to get out of town. Says he's prepared to blow the whistle on a primo reefer distribution ring. Says he Has can... Has he said how much it's going to cost? 50 bucks. And the department will front me the 50? You can put in an expense claim. He's over at Mike Lyman's on Hollywood Boulevard. See what you can find out. Vale, pues vamos. A ver, ¿por dónde coño se es? Por aquí no. 50 bucks? Do they think I made of money? No, you just look like you're made of money. Oh, very good. The kids on form. I'd say on a scale of dull to scintillating, you're a solid tedious today, which you can be pleased with. Salida. Do you ever listen to yourself? I don't have the same voices in my head as you do, Cole. Ah, vale, ya lo tengo marcado. Vámonos. Middle of the afternoon, this crazy woman decides to set fire to the hotel she lives in. The fire brigade come and put it out. A couple hours later, she does it again. Phones up Central and says, I've set fire to my hotel twice today. You better come and get me. <laughs> Did they send some uniforms around to get her? No, that's the best part. The desk sergeant, he gets his share of crank calls, says, all right, lady. ¿Quién es? ¿Dónde? That's him in the back, Cole. Este. Eres tú. Freddy. You're looking good. You're gonna help me, right? That's what I'm here for. You got the money? The 20? Sure, right here. 20? I said... You want the money or the alternative? Tell us about the reefer, Freddy. Who's he? Another good Samaritan. Answer the question. Grass comes from Tijuana. They bring in 50 pounds a week. 50 pounds? Are you hallucinating, Freddy? Get stashed at a house at 1452 North Las Palmas. Names, Freddy. The guy at the house is a spick that goes by the name Juan Garcia Cruz. But be careful. He likes guns. Now do I get my money? Do me a favor, Freddy. Spend the money on a bus ticket. You can't last forever on a snitch jacket. Let's go visit this Cruz character. 50 pounds of dope. Crazy. Uh, wait here. Vale. You believe the story? Sure. A hophead like Freddy would raffle his sister for his next score. Hombre, con 20 pavos en esa época, ojo cuidado, no son 20 pavos ahora, eh. En esa época estaba todo más barato, ¿sabes? Esto quiere decir. Coño, de verdad. ¿O escucháis la sirena, hostia? Ojo, cuidado.
¡Hostia! Vale, vale Pero... Pues métete, métete para adentro, hijo de la gran puta No recargas, ¿cuántas balas tienes? No, gilipollas. Primero miramos los brazos, por si acaso, bueno, vamos, cabeza, brazos, y luego ya el cuerpo, que en la chaqueta tendrá algo interesante. Brazos nada. Y ya vamos a ver aquí. Garcia Cruz. This is his address, but this place looks like a front. A silver dollar. I thought they took these things out of circulation. Massa, Massachusetts. Número, no sé qué, Massachusetts. Entiendo. Me la guardo. Ah, no, más Sankai. ¿Será más Sankai? Espera, espera, espera. Ah, no. Junkies feeding on popcorn and grasshoppers living in soup. Never the same, are they? ¿Qué es esto? Seems irrelevant. Ah, vale. Don't think this is anything. Vale. Vale. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Phelps badge we'll 1247. How can I help, detective? I need an address on a Parnell Soup Company, a head office or factory in the Los Angeles area. Just a second, detective. Address listed, 6310 Fountain Avenue. Thanks for your help. Diccionario español inglés. No hay mucho más, ¿no? Ah, 
no, aquí no he mirado. Sí, 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 que sí, que, que sí. Déjame. Esto no creo que... ¿O oh, sí? Guys keeping one so well stocked with soup. Pero todavía no está todo. Pero esto no me ves nada, ¿no? Sí. Ah, una puta botella, de eh, cojones, tronco. Revisar todos los botes, ¿no? Hijo de puta, qué susto me ha dado el cabronazo. Phelps, you jump like a girl. ¡Hostia! Tijuana, 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 Tijuana. This guy EJ seems to be bringing in most of the serious weight. The dates and times seem pretty regular. We should notify the border crossing. Those fuckers are probably in on it. Let's wait and see how this plays out. Oh, oh. I'd say that's pretty good value for 12 cents. Factory seal. Someone at the cannery has a lot of explaining to do. Tenemos dos sitios, ¿no? A los que ir. Creo. Sí, 
saber, 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 no me pites, no saber, saber. Podía haberle esperado, en verdad, sabes. Pero bueno. Porque estaba ya a punto. La, la única vez que no esperé al otro compañero era porque... Estaba ahí. Esto no sé si se teletransporta. Vamos a ver ahora. Supongo que sí. ¡Ah, no! A medias. Right. Let's see if we can find out who's been overseasoning the soup in this place. Detenida. LAPD. Who owns this factory, ma'am? Mr. Parnell. Howard Parnell. I'll let him know you're here. Please, take a seat. If you don't mind, we'll come with you. If you must. You just wanted to follow her, didn't you? You sly dog. I must apologize for my partner's roving eye. He hates saying goodbye, but he loves watching them leave. Give it a rest, Roy. If you could show these men in to see Mr. Parnell, Doris. They're from the LAPD. Follow me, gentlemen. What is going on? Buenas tardes. LAPD. Sit tight, fatso. You could be in very serious trouble. There's no reason to be rude. Take a seat, gentlemen. I'm sure we can sort this all out. Maybe you can explain why we found $5 bags of marijuana in sealed Parnell soup cans. That's an outrageous allegation. How do you explain it, Chubby? We found at least 30 cans, all sealed up tight with your label on them. Can I get a list of your employees? Of course. We have nothing to hide. Doris? Can you bring me in the current employee listing? Here it is, Mr. Parnell. On the desk, please. Any name on that list that rings a bell? Me tengo que acordar yo. De otros... De otros nombres. De otros casos. ¿Cómo era? Espérate. Ay, ¿por qué no me deja abrir mi libreta? Pero serás hijos de hijo de puta. ¿Cómo se llamaba Juan no sé qué Márquez? Juan García... No sé qué, ¿no? Jo Jorge García Cruz. This is familiar. 1452 North Los Palmas. A Jorge García Cruz. ¿A qué más? Ah, no. ¿Ever heard of Juan García Cruz? Not that I know of. He has a brother employed here. You know him? We employ large numbers of Mexicans. I, I'm not familiar with them all. Completamente inexpresivo. You're not the type of boss who talks to his workers? I am, but a lot of them don't have much English. Ah, pues de puta madre, muy bien. How are your sales, Mr. Parnell? Just fine and dandy, son. We're entering a new era of prosperity. I hope you're both big soup eaters. Mr. Parnell, do you know what kind of trouble you're in? Come clean with us. Okay, so things are a little flat. We're deciding whether to lower production. It's taken a while to adjust to not having any military contracts. You know, we sold Uncle Sam five million cans of minestrone. The factory sealed cans we found suggest a very professional operation, Mr. Parnell. We're looking for an inside man. I know nothing about this. I want this stopped as much as you do. 
Tell me what I want to know, Parnell, or I will have half the LAPD down here tearing this place apart. You're hiding something. Am I right in thinking you would not want to pursue misdemeanors outside your drug case? Depending on what you call a misdemeanor, we might be prepared to turn a blind eye. The truth is I employ a lot of illegals. No one wants to do menial work anymore. Most of my factory staff are wetbacks. Pero bueno. The local blacks and Chicanos all want jobs in aircraft factories. Presumably because the pay is a lot better. Claro. Te iba a decir, te digo un truco, págales más. Tell us about Jorge Garcia Cruz. Jorge? I had no idea of his last name. His team does daily maintenance on the conveyor belts and cookers. You're being made a patsy by a dope ring, Parnell, and you're happy to sit here and let it happen. You want my help? I said I'd help. You want to call me names? You can go fuck yourself. We'd like to take a look around the factory floor, Mr. Parnell. I hope we won't have to shut down the line. No, nothing like that. Thank you. I'm grateful for that. I'll show you around myself. Me deben un puto punto de intuición los ojos de puta. I hate seeing how things are made. This is going to be like that time I went to the slaughterhouse and couldn't eat steak for a week. Y encima me ponen completamente inexpresivas las caras a este pavo. Yo qué sé qué cojones, de verdad, mentira o la madre que le parió. Tía, las texturas ahí, eh. This is where the produce comes in. We peel and sort all of the vegetables and add them to the line in regular quantities. Fascinating. Why don't you keep quiet? I learned something. Oh, good God. This really is turning into some nightmare school trip flashback. This is the hopper, which boils and purees the vegetables. The other hopper is for the pasta. This way, please. You're loving this, aren't you, Phelps? The soup is ladled automatically in the can. Next stage is labeling. I'd like to see the packing and dispatch area, if you don't mind. Sure. It's over here. Follow me. This is one of our dispatchers. Sergio, right? Yes, sir. These men are from the LAPD. Sergio here records our outgoing deliveries. They all go in the book. Just there on the desk. Espérate, espérate, espérate. to come back at night to find out. Pues te abro la otra también. Da igual, por joder. Veinte centuries market, mucho, eh. What's going on, Parnell? There's enough soup going to this place every day to feed a company of Marines. What are you talking about? Can I have a look at that coin? Sure, why not? Silver dollar, right? Yeah, that's right. 
The markings on it say it's been taken out of circulation. Maybe. I'm not trying to buy anything with it. I like it. It brings me luck. Do you have access to the canning area? I do. But I keep to my station. Loading and unloading. Don't care much for soup. Niente. Sergio, if you don't give me something, I'm gonna go to immigration services and have you deported. I get a shipment once every two weeks. Ernesto does the driving. I don't know his full name. It's delivered here at night, or he gets it canned up. From here it gets sent all over the country. Jorge. Jorge Garcia Cruz. What do you know about the 20th century market? Nada. I get the orders from upstairs. I send the goods where I'm told. And you don't know Juan Garcia Cruz? No. Not me. You're a liar, Sergio. You're in it, and I'm gonna break you for it. You're loco, placa. I got nothing to do with Juan Garcia. We found a matching silver dollar on Juan Garcia. What are the odds of that, Sergio? Juan and Jorge are in brothers. They're cousins. They work for some evil gabacho. The guy is an aberration. He gives out the silver dollars. Or he gets me a list of deliveries every morning. 20th century is always on. You keep your mouth shut for today and I don't take you in. Do we have a deal? Do I have a choice? Is that a serious question? That's it for now, Sergio. If we need to speak to you again, we'll put in a call to Mr. Parnell. If you have to, I guess. We will be in touch, Mr. Parnell. It is imperative that things appear as normal here. Keep an eye on Sergio in case he gets tempted to blow the whistle. Thanks. I'll do that. You're going to overlook my little immigration problem, aren't you? Cheer up, fatso. We're going to let you go on squeezing these poor saps a little while longer. Well, until some commie union types infiltrate this place. I think. I am glad to be out of that place. I never knew fresh vegetables could smell so bad. Buah, tantas ahí y todo el proceso. Aparte del calor, tiene que haber una peste. Entonces, que me, que me aclare yo. Tenemos que ir al mercado ahora, ¿no? Aunque creo que he gastado el punto de intuición muy rápido, pero si no, no hubiera sacado yo... How many years have you been in Vice, Roy? More years than I want to own up to, Phelps. You have any idea who Rojas was talking about? The gringo runs the operation? Could be anybody. You don't expect those morons to be running the show, do you? You ask Roas how much a silver dollar is worth, he'd probably say 50 cents. Es que no tengo puntos. No tengo puntos de intuición. Es que va a ir como el ojal esto, ¿eh? Ya estoy viendo yo que no, esto no, no va a salir bien. Pero bueno. A ver si hay suerte. Take a look at what's going on. Either these customers are serious soup lovers, or I think we found our middleman. 
Car 11 King to KGPL. Car 11 King, go ahead. I'm requesting assistance in a B wagon at 20th Century Markets, 1558 North Highland. Numerous narcotic suspects. Code 2 only, no sirens. 11K, Roger. Okay. Cavalry should be here any minute. Chances. Ah, por eso. Whatever you're carrying, hand it over. Vaya, vaya. I'd say he's got about half a can left. I guess that makes me a pessimist. You can't take me in. Take you in? Be glad he didn't shoot you. I wouldn't have chased you. If it was up to me, you'd be talking out of a hole in the back of your I head. I want information. Senor, I would like to help you. But I got a family in Mexico I have to provide for. And my compadres are very unreasonable. Your compadres? Turn out your pockets. Vaya, vaya. I need Ray to run down these silver dollars. Why can't we get any closer? I need to make a deal. I need guarantees. You have identification? Sanchez Erto, Mexican, Tijuana address. Here's the deal, Erto. You give me information, and I won't give you to immigration. Conocimiento de EJ. ¿Quién cojones es? No, gilipollas. Don't go. I will give you all the help I can. Pero si es que no me quiero ir. Hostia. We know about Jorge and Juan. Juan is dead. Tell us how you know the Cruz boys. And that's to put together this thing. He brought in Juan, Juan brought in Jorge. Dice la verdad, ¿no? Continue. I was already here. Ernesto knows I'm illegal, so he threatened to report me if I didn't help. And the money is good. The gringos and the gringas, they love the reefer. And I didn't want to have to leave and start again in San Francisco. You're breaking my heart. Tell me about the soup cans. The soup is very popular, as you can see. I think you're the connection on the Mexican side. I think you're more than you like to make out. So now I'm the big man in this? I okay. have dreams. I want to make enough to bring my family over. O sea, tengo que demostrar que la sopa no es sopa, demuestro sopa de marihuana, o sea, que es marihuana, no, toma, lo voy a tomar por culo. Give me EJ, the driver bringing in the shipments, or I'll make you for it. I run the shop, that's all I do. Yo que sé, ya. Puedo decir que duda, no sé. Start talking, Erto. I want the names of everyone involved. What difference does it make what I tell you? I'm still going to jail, no? You're going to jail, Erto. Pero que hostia. Our jails may be nicer than what you could expect in Mexico, but I can tie you up in red tape for years. You've got this one chance to cooperate, Erto. Give me your delivery, boys. Or you'll do every year that we were saving for them. All right. I... There's a shipment coming in tonight to the soup factory, Parnell's soup factory, 1 a.m. Ernesto will be there. <laughs> <laughs> 
We should get some backup and stake out the cannery tonight. Pero qué puta mierda, tío. Es que no tiene sentido nada. Freddy said they were moving 50 pounds a week. That's a lot of soup can. I think this is an interstate operation. Moving dope around the country to selected grasshoppers. Local weed gets distributed in the usual way, through Pachuco street punks. Someone must know something about this drug baron character. Here they come. Let them unload the goods first. Now, let's get them. Por aquí. LAPD, put your hands where we can see them. Weapons on the ground now. Pero esto es gilipollas, de verdad. ¿Por qué se cruza, hostia, tío, de verdad? What? Está pasando. Detectives, found something here you probably want to see. Okay. Sí, hay un muerto, he sido yo. ¿Qué pasa? One dollar per dead man. Doesn't seem like much for a human life. Ernesto. Si you want an address, we should see what the federales have on it. Mar de hierba. Pero 
que ha encontrado. O sea, una un dólar de plata, sí, ya sabemos que está metido en el asunto. Por eso lo hemos matado, quiero decir. O sea, ¿qué cojones? Bueno, que es el tal, el, el, el tal Ernesto, hostia. God damn. I think we found our stash, Cole. Take a look in these boxes. At the very minimum another 50 pounds. Detectives, I think we got the guy. Does the name Cruz mean something to you? It certainly does. ¿Y qué? ¿Pero qué me quieres decir? ¿Este? There are letters cut into each coin, along with not legal tender. What does it mean? Those are Morgan silver dollars from the 20s. They were removed from circulation and sent for disposal. A number of smelters around the country had the contract. Look at them together. Can you work out what it says? Vamos a ver, caraculo. ¡Hostia! Estate quieto, joder. Tú. Lo primero. No. The third K A Y, the fourth M E T, the fifth A L S, Mesang K Metals. A metal foundry. Would you like the address? Would I ever? 1034 Vine Street, Hollywood. We'll finish up here. It's already been a long night, Phelps. See if you can talk them into giving themselves up. Tenía lo de Mesang K en. Una hoja de papel, los cruz. Los, los, sí, los cruz. Ahora corres más, ¿eh? Sabes que te dejo atrás. Buah, la voy a cagar muchísimo con las preguntas. Verás tú. ocurre otra entrada Look where you're going. Espera, espera, espera Sé que no me va a dejar, pero voy a coger más carrerilla ¿Pero qué verja es esta?
Pero aquí nada, ¿no? No. No creo, vamos. ¿Estamos alguien vivo o no hace falta? Con círculo se recarga, nunca me acuerdo, tío. Ah, coño, que es él. Le iba a disparar. Es el compañero, joder. Sanders. You know this guy? I should have known. Of course I know Roy. Roy and I have had an arrangement for Get many up. years. You're under arrest. Am I? We have a honest. mountain of prima facie evidence, as well as the testimony. You'd be surprised how things have a habit of sorting themselves out. Evidence disappearing. Witnesses that can't be found. Policemen that forget. The impossible becomes probable when you have a client list like mine. Shut your mouth! Turn around and put your hands behind your back. Working vice can be a thankless task, Phelps. But on behalf of the brass and the moms and dads and the concerned citizens, I'd like to commend you and your partner for smashing this dope ring. Reefer is almost as big a threat to the children of this city as communism. What about Sanders, Lieutenant? Leave Sanders to me, Phelps. The chief will be looking after that one personally. He will be brought to trial. Phelps, we are celebrating your success. Don't push your luck. Sanders is no longer your problem. O sea, lo hemos conseguido, pero muy al límite, ¿no? O sea, por las preguntas... Madre de Dios. An Sánchez es una ante evidencia insuperable. Ya, bueno, pero si funciona como el culo, pues yo qué sé. Bueno, vamos a ver el siguiente caso y lo dejamos aquí. Your platoon is what remains of recon. I'm folding you into the 22nd. You'll be going up that damned hill tonight. We're intelligence gathering, sir. I don't need intelligence, son. I need men who can hold rifles and kill Japs. Tonight, you're a rifle company. We've got cooks, mechanics, and stretcher bearers all going into the line. 
We aim to break them tonight, Lieutenant. Good to see you, Hank. You too, Cole. How's your war? Not quite what I expected. As long as I live, I will never get over that sound. Hey, who's that medic? He'll be killed going out there. It's Sheldon, the guy from the Alcacala Bridge. That guy's got no fear. He didn't make it. I didn't go out there to save him. What are you saying, man? I went out there to put him out of his misery, to ease his pain. Do you have a problem with that? Murder, Corman. That's war, Lieutenant. Smell the stench. Feel the horse breath on your neck. You need help, man. Call for me tonight, Lieutenant. When you're up on that hill. I've been up there three times already. The circles of hell have nothing on Sugarloaf Hill. Get this madman out of my sight! Este es el de la droga que se hizo amigo del otro que también nos odiaba, creo. You like the fight game, Phelps? I did a little boxing in the Marines. I found it a pretty humbling experience. See a sandwich, buddy? Corned beef and egg salad, 12 cents. Bologna and ham and cheese, 10. It's strictly a mugs game. You'll like this fight, though. A plucky limey's about to take a beating from an up-and-coming Negro. You sound pretty sure about the result. I ought to be. I got 50 bucks on the black kid. <laughs> Let's get a ringside seat. Son of a bitch Hammond made a run for his dressing room. Let's find out what's going on. God damn you, Albert! You get out here right now! Step back! LAPD. De momento lo vamos a dejar aquí. En el próximo ya continuaremos. Por el momento hasta aquí. Así que espero que os haya gustado. Muchas gracias por estar ahí un día más aguantándome. En el próximo continuaremos. Gracias. Hasta luego.